Welcome, 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 welcome. Welcome, welcome. Who I love. Okay. Who I love. Um, Lost Lou is in my Aries. Lost Lou Taurus. Lost Lou Taurus. Okay. Um, let's see what my little Taurians are up to. My little bulls. Alright, I hope you're not being bull headed. How about we grab the effing bulls by the horn and we, and we press our via. I feel like. I feel like really good stuff coming to you guys. I know my Tauruses have had kind of like a, a rough, a rough year, you know. Um, it's just like can't catch a break, some of you, you know. And it's like the wait, some are just waiting. Others can't catch a break. Like you know, you tend to be a little stubborn. All right, so but. I'm feeling, feeling a nice shift for you guys, okay? And it has nothing to do with Venus being here. Well, I'm sure it does, but, like, I feel like, if anything, we was, because I'm, I'm Taurus Venus, and I think we were supposed to, like, get it harder, you know what I mean? Like, learning certain, like, really lessons so we can get, get past the crap to, to get to the new, to get the abundance, that kind of stuff. But, um, I'm not feeling, like, difficult, like, energy with the, this this two weeks, I kind of feel like just stuff's kind of smooth for you guys right now. You know what I mean? Um, so we just pulled the wedding card. You know how I feel about that one. I was like, here I am talking. But, you know, make the effort. So I just think you're probably dealing with somebody from your past. All right? Um, don't sweat it. Don't sweat it. All right? Yeah, see? Time, like I just said, like, don't sweat it. Like, work it out. Sweat it out. All right? Release your energy. Um, somebody wants to make an effort, whether it's you or this other person, but like whatever negative it is you're holding on to, just you know, let it like let it go. I think it's gonna be nice energy for you to just be able to release, to be honest with you. Um so pay attention to red flags. It's clearly you, you know, it, it, it's something you're not you're not seeing. Okay, we definitely have a trust issue, you know, if trust came in, right under that wedding card with that, that one person. I don't I'm not crazy about that card, all right? Free yourself. Take control over your life. Like, you you have power of that. Like, that, it's yours, you know? Like, romantic feelings. Like, somebody has feelings for you. It's obviously probably this person or somebody else or vice versa. Um, but you're not, you're not seeing something because you're not releasing something. I'm, I'm telling you right now is the energy, all right? Um, you deserve love. Keep an open mind. I want this one. All right, and, it, and it's safe. All right, so you feel like right off the bat, it, it's not even, it's, it's not a safe scenario. To me, this looks like you guys just want to, like, get rid of this. All right, you, some of you want to make the app in, and others are just like, nope. Okay. Um, and others of you are just kind of like, you have, you have feelings for somebody, somebody new. All right, this is weird. My Aries had three different stories, too. I, I see at least two stories here. All right, definitely trust issues with this person coming back around. Or you, or it's you going towards somebody and you want to make the effort. But to me, it looks like this person's coming to you because you're trying to release it. You're trying to let this go. All right, like you've kept an open mind, you know, like. But there's got to still be some feelings there because it, it's. It's like, is it safe? Is it not safe? Do I want to do this? Do I not want to do this? And that's because of the trust. And yet the spirit's sending you a message that you're not seeing. It's not a bad, like, red flag, but it, it's something. Taurus, Taurus, tell me about wedding. It's, it's the Queen of Pence, so this is, the Queen of Pence is somebody who's very nurturing, gives gives her time, all right, I, you know, looking right towards the future with the Three of Wands, um, I don't know why I kept going, this person is watching you, and there's still secrets, okay, with the moon, you got the Nine of Swords with the moon, you know, there, there's something, um,
to me, you just, you don't know whether or not. And like I said, see, some of you are waiting. Like the Queen of Pence is, is waiting. Or you just had the inner knowing that this person was coming back. It, no, it's not that. But I called it, so some of you just know. But I feel like this person's in your energy field right now. Because with this make the effort, I kept going. This has to go with this, but this lays on top of this. Like this person who wants to come in and make the effort. You know, I, I just don't know if like... If that's a restriction lifted. Tell me about the moon. Um, five of wands and the nine of pence. This is more of like temptation, like a lust. Um, there's still conflict when it comes to this. Whether or not you're going to go towards the unknown of this person. is. See, this is tough because you, this person that's on your mind is all up in your energy. Some of you just, and you know it, and that's, you're trying to release it right now. You're, you're, you're like, it's exhausting to you, what, this person that's still here and around up in your energy field. All right. You you want this new start. And I don't, some it's with this person and, and others it is not. Okay. It's just, <laughs> or it is, and you want to release all all the conflict and, and let it go. Somebody thinks they have competition too. Tell me about pay attention to red flags. All right, the yeah the sun it's you're not seeing something. This this isn't like the 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 zodiac. This is this is clarity because yeah, it was reversed. You yeah, you're not you're not seeing something. All right, and then I have a pen. So it's something with this person. It's like, and he looks sneaky as F, all right? But you're, this is the lust part, okay? Like, this is why the, I see, like, I see jealousy. I see lust. I see temptation. Look at him, though. He looks sneaky. But you're all enjoying the moment, okay? I don't like that. To me, I feel like you got, some of you got to watch your back. So we have. There was definitely deception. There was playing. Uh, to me, this was somebody was trying to make the effort and somebody else just wasn't having it. Somebody wanted that new stat. Or somebody wants to release all this shit to have a new stat. Like, they got their own clarity. They're not messing around with this anymore. I'm telling you, it's two different stories like that. Tell me about trust. Um, you yeah, like trust, you know? Yeah, see the emperor like that. You can usually trust the emperor, but again, this is the emperor's fucking their ways. They, they demand things, but... Usually, you know, when you get to this point in your life, you know, it's like you deserved what you have, but like, I just, I feel like this emperor is going about it the wrong way and you don't want to trust this person. You just don't. All right. Because to me, the way he's looking, you're, you're literally trying to, um, there's justice with another knife of chalices. You're, you're literally trying to, you know, free yourself. It's time to take your own control back. And this person's been controlling your energy. Look at them looking right, like, right at you. You're trying to get, some of you are trying to get away from this person that's controlling. Um, some of you... want to balance out the scales with this person and some of you do not it looks like somebody's ready to write somebody a letter but somebody still thinks there's something tricky going on so we have two different stories on the board guys sorry it's going to be a little tougher for you to to um to read okay because some want this and some and some do not it's not contradicting energy some do not and some do it's, it's that simple tell me about romantic feelings um yeah the the three of the the three of chalices okay um it would come up this way you got every knife you got every page on the board now okay you got the page of one somebody wants somebody to take action when it comes to this 
Um, and then others don't. Others who are wrapping it up. Okay. Um, and then you got the King of Wands and the Three of Cups. So others want this union to come back into union. Okay. Others, there's there's a could be a third party situation that just wrapped up or is about to wrap up because somebody had feelings for somebody else and it looks like somebody's leaving somebody for someone else. Okay. Others are just like, I deserve way more than this and I'm out. All right. This is this is not all the same story. Yeah, see the six of wands, like you deserve love. You you know that you, you deserve more than what you're getting in certain scenarios and you're, you're, I mean, you're out, especially with the nine of chalices. This is you seeking your own fulfillment, okay? Like, because you're not happy. Tell me about keeping an open mind. Um, Ace of Swords. So, some some are are keeping that clarity, and then we got the you got the Three of Swords with the the Seven of Wands, and and some are just straight up effing guarded. This is so nuts. This is, I'm telling you right now, this is not contradicting energy. This is straight up. Some people really want this and others are like, no, it's not happening. Oh, stay for you to love. Okay. Tell me about stay for you to love. Um, it's the two of swords. You're like, I I'm not making this decision. I'm not listening to promises. Like, you're not doing it. All right, you, you don't want to have a conversation. You don't want to choose a direction. Some of you are wrapping this up and you're done. Others, we have we have jealousy on the board too. We have temptation on the board. We have every single page on the board, every page. Okay, so there's there's definitely a third party somewhere too. Um, that's for very few, it, very few with this third party, but. I think this third party was part of the path. I don't even think it takes partakes in this read right now. Okay. Um, and yeah, see, some with the tower, you know, some it's to build all over again, and others it's you're straight up done. You're not tolerating this. But I think this person that's watching you is all conflicted whether or not they want to make an effort. And, and you're that person where you're just like, I'm not, don't even bother thinking about what it is you want to think about because you're not having that. You're, you're just not having it, you know? Um, you released it and you, you started new. You you saw your own clarity. Like, you're like sneaky. No, I'm telling you. So for others that want this, you're still dealing with somebody who's who's possibly trying to control the situation somehow, okay, regardless of a little bit of feeling, it, it's, this is tough, because those who want this back, They're not letting me figure it out. But they're still letting me go with cards. So that means I'm not meant to figure it out for you. So I would use your, your best judger character. Like the high priestess isn't even here saying use your gut. Like this is like. The wheel's not even here either. This is on you. Like. Some of you straight up wrapping it up. So I'm going to go around one more time and you're going to have to decipher this energy yourselves. This is tough. Some of you are getting out of it and it's not even an issue. And others are, are contemplating going towards somebody or taking someone back. Tell me about wedding. Um, this is the only one that flipped was the nine. The nine of cups. Okay. Um.
but this is somebody unhappy. This is un ungrateful. Okay, so I don't know if you're ungrateful for somebody or somebody's just ungrateful for you. Somebody about make the effort. You know, we got the hangman, so it's like somebody needs to sacrifice something or change their perspective. And happy squirrel came out, guys. So this is what I'm saying. Like, this is really weird. They're, they want me to stop your reading. And they're not letting me figure it out for you. So, I'm going to pull you another quick one, okay, because I need to stop this one. That's how it works. And, but I'm telling you, some, this is your, your no, and others, um, some of you want it, but I, I don't see what you see there. I, I don't see why. I don't see why you would, because... I don't see anything good guys like that, you know, and, but I can like feel it. So I don't know if this is all past energy and this person's coming back around and all this is going to be up in your energy because it's all going to be resurfaced. Okay. So at the same time, it's like, you're saying I deserve love. You don't feel like it's safe. You deserve so much more. I don't know if this person has changed or not, okay? That's it's, that's up to you. But like I said, there wasn't like the, the high priestess. There was just certain things that just weren't there that said, you know, they want X, Y, Z. Or that, that's, that's, that's tough, okay? Because that's the energy you're going to be in when somebody comes back around. Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. This could be quick. Um... You're going to be all confused and not knowing what to do, or you're just, some of you will not, and you're just wrapping it up, all right? But that's going to be the same damn card first out, wedding, okay? This is, it's, it's not really going to give me a new story. I'm going to pull a couple more, and then you, you're not with this person right now, but this is exactly how you're going to feel when this person comes back, all right? This could be the one, same thing, clearly decide what it is you want, okay? So... Um, so I'm not holding on to this lover. Well, this lover's holding on to you. All right. It's, there's, I'm seeing the same cards, the moon, all that stuff. Um, tell me about wedding. about wedding that was the four of swords so whatever this is you've you've already healed from this so that's probably why you're like why why would i want this back around that was a tower and the king of swords reverse i mean the king of pence oh, another one reversed i mean flipped okay Tell me about wedding Eight of Wands, you're going to get a message from this person. That was a two of swords. You're going to get a message, and you're not even talking to this person right now. There's distance between the two of you, um, but this person is going to reach out, okay? Um, and it, it might just even be out of the blue with the King, Knight of Swords. The Knight of Swords is, I, I mean, I don't even, I wouldn't even want a message from the Knight of Swords. You know, it, it's like harsh communication. It, it's like, Why? You know, why be, see what I'm saying? Like, why did, why would you want that? Okay. Tell me about separation. So, this is tough because, you know, there's a tool, the two of swords, you know, making a decision whether or not this person is going to come back to have a new start. This person wants to come back and have a new start with you. And I don't know what you're going to do. Tell me about, this could be the one. So again, it, it's like the same story, the same storyline, and I think you already know, all right, it's, there's that King of Pence again. So the Four of Swords, all the ones that were actually flipped that I put back, all right? So you've already healed from this situation, and now this person is coming back around, and 
the the message they're gonna send you is is, is on top of it is f and hash like wow I, I you know Taurus I'm really sorry because this is um this is a very tough read for you it's you gotta make a decision and it's not really telling you you know, a gut decision, a soul decision, um, a practical decision. Uh, <laughs> this is what I'm saying. Like, you're on your own. Like, you're, I got the goosebumps. You're, you're on your own with this one, guys. And that's probably best because, like I said, you've had it rough. Okay, you've, you've had this. And it's not that I spoke too soon. It's you're going to make the right decisions. You're going to make what the right decision that's best for you. Okay. So let's see if we can get some advice with the Moonology card for my Tauruses because you're on your own. Okay, so check your other signs, please. Okay, well, anything else? Flip? That came out so, I don't know if you noticed that, but it came out very gently. You know, it says luck is on your side. So, the song says a lot too. Okay. One day, and this could be, this could be either or same situation like a 50 50 either or whatever you choose it's just one day but um it's not about win or lose it, see some of you are going to take it and some of you are not and it, it it talks about a lot of things it's um who sings this it's um acorns in it okay but like um how do you say that master shushi no mass M A T I S Y A H U. It's just it's one day featuring Acon. It will come up, okay? Um, but it it says a lot. So this that is con confirmation for me to tell you the same thing with this decision we've been talking about. Okay, all my life you've been waiting for a certain sign, waiting for, praying for, working towards. Okay, so it's it could be you too, just getting you know luck on your side, you getting yourself. Uh, this situation feeling victorious you know you don't need this or this is something that can work out for you too so one day and it talks about the new moon and this is the new moon so this is this is the energy okay so Whatever is coming your way, it looks like you're about to put a smile on your face. The new moon is a mark of a restart of a fun period of, of feeling certain after feeling low. The energy is adventurous, okay? It, but you're going to need to take a few risks. Be careful that you don't that you don't bet the farm on something as the wheel of fortune is about to spring again. This card is about exploring and, and having new ideas and thinking about your own philosophies. Perhaps it's time to change your mindset about something important. It can also single signify a trip on the way. You did have the world too. If something, if you're working towards something, keep going and achieve it, okay? There, there will be a gift and you don't even see it coming. It says count your blessings, like literally write them down. And then additional meanings is you need to laugh more. This is a wonderful time for you to start a course of studying or teaching. Don't be narrow-minded. It says start a new, start a new week of gratitude practice. Okay. Um, it just talks about being on a, a new quest and feeling upbeat and lucky. Okay. So, and I told you I felt that. Okay. But I, I'm also telling you that whatever's coming in, that that's that's the energy that's going to be stirred. It's the energy that's going to resurface. All right, but at the same time, it's saying luck is on your side. So, like I said, 50-50 for you guys. This can go in any direction. All right, this is this is on you. This is strictly on you. And the way they left this up too is 50-50. All 
All right, you take that how you want to take that too, because that's how that was too. All right. So, you know, it's just expect an energy shift, like I talked about that I felt, which is beautiful. So I'm, I'm glad my intuition was was right about that. I couldn't figure out all that mumbo jumbo because that's exactly what it is. It's the past, you know, let bygones be bygones, move on together or without. It was just 24, 24. And I just said, move, move on together or without. So let's see if that's any help for you guys. And please go Google this yourself too, to get more insight out of it. But It relates to duality, finding balance, partnerships, relationships, intuition, patience, consideration. All right, it's it's just your life purpose, it's your soul missions, it's it's going through, it's it's the truth, it's you know practicality, it's solid foundations, it's planning, it's you know being determined. Um, it tells you to be patient. You know, there's there's a bigger plan that needs to fall fall into place so the right doors and opportunities can pre present themselves at the exact time. Rather than jump first thing, you know, just look at what's in front of you, that kind of stuff. Um, wait for clear and obvious signs type things to go in certain directions. Don't be too hasty when making choices or decisions either. And you saw that hasty message too. Um, trust yourself to continue on whatever path you choose. So you're going to have a choice, all right? Um, but don't stay in the same path you're in right now. Get yourself out of that. Trust your intuition. You'll know what path to take. Um Consider all your options and, and weigh up what's truly important to you. Don't waste your time and efforts on activities and people, especially who don't support you. But rather choose to spend your time doing things on, on time and effort on things and people that suit your true self and resonate with you and your life purpose. Okay, you're very intuitive, you know, in this situation. So ex expand your intuitive right, right now and, and trust that things will just fall into place. Um, you will get the, you will... You follow your heart, your, your your soul, your mind, body, passion, all of it, okay? It, it will lead you into the right desired result. Have faith faith and trust, all right? Um, and it will bring rewards no matter what you choose. And it's funny because, was it you guys or my concern? I don't know. It was like one of those situations that when no matter what you choose, a reward's going to come to you because of all your hard work and efforts paying off. See what I'm saying? So, again, 50-50. I love you guys so much. Just have a fantastic week.